hello, hello, and welcome to another episode of Crazy Town Gaming. My name is Jonas, I'm your host, and I am here rolling solo dolo on this Madden 19 franchise of the Austin Desperados. So basically, this is year one for the Austin Desperados. Uh, if you watched the last video... I took the Denver Broncos, I completely deconstructed them and traded away like all of their players that were over 30, all their stars, things like that, and then relocated them to Austin, Texas, where the crazy town is located. Um, so now we're in the offseason. Um, my team just needs a lot of players. It doesn't have very many people at all. So basically what I've already done is this is the first round of free agents. I have went in and I did some negotiations. Um, there's one guy, this guy, he's a, he's a, like a star, basically. Um, all the rest of them are just kind of some average type players just to sort of fill in some gaps. So before I show you where the roster is, I'm going to go ahead and advance this week to week two so I can see if any of these guys sign, and then we can kind of see where I'm at. And I'm going to go ahead and try to make some. Let's see. So one, two, three... And oh, I hired a coach that I didn't. Uh, that I didn't. Uh, oh, cool! None of my offers were accepted, so they've hired a coach for me. So that's cool. All right. Well, I guess I'll. Uh, I guess I'll fire him if I need to. All right. So I only got a couple guys. So let me go ahead and see what the team looks like now. Here is where we're at. We have a long way to go to rebuild. Austin Desperados. That was kind of the whole point of this, is that I would completely tear down a team and see how long it takes to rebuild it up. Um, so obviously I need a quarterback. Uh, this guy is not. <laughs> he's not going to be the guy of the future. Halfbacks. Um, these guys are young, but none of them really took off last season. They'll all be replaced for sure. So um, my fullback. Uh, he's so so. Wide receiver. So. So basically, I got some pretty trash wide receivers. Um, he will definitely not be the main guy on my team. So we'll see. That guy was a rookie, so maybe I'll see if I can bring him up, something like that. Tight end. Um, average. So, I mean, the team isn't, like, god-awful, but, oh, I do have an 80 on the line here. Um, so let's see. My line is, ooh, line's fucking garbage pretty much. Um... No right tackles, all right. So then so then I got a little bit of depth. I mean, most of the guys are in the 70s here. Um, I have to check my coaching scheme. I'm going to set it up for what I want because I'm not sure what this guy has that they gave me. Um, I've got some line, so I need linebacker. I basically need everything. Um, middle linebacker. I have a couple. That guy's old. He's getting, the, he's getting the hell out of here. What is he? He has to be... A, oh, it's because of his salary. It'll give me a huge cap penalty if I get rid of him. So, All right. So I got some decent linebackers. Maybe I will switch to a 4 or 3-4. Um, I got some okay uh, cornerbacks. I mean, it's not great, but... Oh, free safety, I'm good. And so my defense is okay. My kicker, he's all right. And I need a punter. Now, look at this. Look at these draft picks. So I got... One one three twos three threes a four five two fives a six two and then next year I have four first round picks. So what I may try to do here is I may just try to trade some of these picks away for some players so I can get some quality players on the team to kind of speed this process up because I got a lot of those draft picks from the players that I got rid of. So let me go ahead and go into the coach here. We'll go ahead and set up a scheme for. See what, see what this dude wants. So he is set for a vertical power run. Um, I think I'm going to run a West Coast zone run. Because that seems to be... Where am I, where am I closest to fitting? Uh, either a multiple zone, a vertical zone. I'm going to run a West Coast zone run maybe. Um, base 3-4. Multiple three four, yeah, it seems to be my best fit. So I think I'll go with a multiple three four defense. Um, let me see here. I'm gonna run a base. No, I'm gonna use a multiple three four. 
All right, so he is a zone run west coast, so that works. And base 4-3, so what kind of multiple 4-3, base 3-4. I think Baltimore is a multiple 4-3. Considering you, for some reason in this game, you can't just set the, the plain playbooks as your start, so multiple 3-4. So I'll run Atlanta's offense, which seems to have shotgun single back. I form strong. Yeah, all right. So I'll probably run Atlanta's offense, and then we will uh, we'll see. I may change this West Coast, depending on what kind of quarterback I can get. So, All right, so that's where we're at now. And then so what I'm going to do, guys, is I'm going to go ahead and do some stuff off screen. I'm going to try to do some trades. I'm going to try to sign some more free agents to fill in some gaps. And then, uh, you know, I'll be, bust, I'll be popping in here. If I, do, if I do get some trades, I'll be popping in with the uh the trades so i will be back as soon as there is something of relevance to impo uh, to report to you guys all right and so the first thing i was able to do here in the off season was uh boost my receiving core a little bit i picked up this guy from the 49ers trent taylor he has two years left on his contract for a sixth round pick he uh he isn't great um but he's he's pretty good uh, as far as like catching and things like that so all right, well, report back when I have anything else to report. Okay, guys, I uh, didn't. I tried to do some other trades. They they were wanting way too much money or way too much draft picks for the player that that I was trying to get. Um, there's not too many players left I want to try to get. Um, I have three negotiations out there just because I need players at these positions. So I'm gonna go ahead and advance to the next week, see if I get any of those, and uh, go from there. All right, so I got that. So I have a right tackle now. I have a the left outside linebacker. So let me see if this center just didn't agree. No, he's still there. So I'm gonna go ahead and advance this last week because there's not really anybody else out there that I want um, to try to sign. So let's go ahead and advance this week again. See if I get him. God, I hope so. I need somebody. All right, cool. He he accepted. So so basically, where we're at is the draft um, because there wasn't really anybody else to trade for. And really the only trade I made was just for a little bit of depth. So if you want to look at the free agency recap, here's who I signed my signings. So basically I got my Tavis Bryant, uh, this Fox dude. And then I got a few guys, uh, Perry, Finney, Halapu, and Henderson. Basically the line was just to get some depth. I'll probably draft some linemen. And just to get a couple guys that were better than what I had. So, all right, let's go ahead and get into the draft here. See if I can get my franchise quarterback. Um, so, we'll go ahead and start the draft and see how things turn out. So, I'm probably going to have to sign some more free agents after. We'll go ahead and pause the draft, skip ahead to the next user pick, and see who is here. Make my selection. Pick player. Come on, quarterback. All right. Oh, nice. So I either get... They're both... Let's see here. Hold on, actually. Ch -ch -ch quarterback. Oh, okay. All right. So we got this dude who's a field general. This dude is a field general. And this dude who is a West Coast, which is kind of what I wanted to run. But... This guy seems to be the best overall. He's not fast, but he his throw power, his throw accuracy, short and mid. Yeah, he's better. This, I mean, this guy's throw power. So I think whatever field general works like, I think I'm gonna go with. I don't. I don't really like this guy too much. So. Let's see what David Kershey has here. Um, he's a mid for... I'm going to go with Eric Arga Monte and see how he does for my... Or Agramonte. There we go. So we'll see how that turns out. All right, wish me luck, guys. Let's see how this goes. <laughs> Good pick. All right, cool. He's ranked, he's ranked eight overall. So he... All right, and he can be West Coast, too. He's, like, almost West Coast, so I really could keep him at West Coast, to be honest, which I may do, to be honest. What's his ratings? Okay. All right, he's a 79 to start. Like, 
That's I mean, he can't break a sack to save his life, but but he's actually not that bad. All right, cool. I'm I'm pretty happy with that pick to be honest. All right, so we'll skip ahead in the draft. Advance to the next user pick. I think I got three picks in the second round. So I plan on using them bitches to get the best available player. All right. God, that quarterback dropped. He must suck. Actually, both of them dropped. Look at those. Huh. All right. Scouted. All right. So who? Ooh, there's a center. And I'm in dire need of a center. God. All right. Look at that. I'm in dire need of a left outside linebacker, too. Mmm. Damn it. Damn it, damn it. I, when, where's my next pick? It, it one, two, three, four, five. All right, I'm gonna te I'm gonna I'm gonna attempt it. I'm gonna take the center first. God, please, please be here. Good, good pick. Okay, now hopefully this left outside linebacker is still there. Please, left off outside linebacker. Please still be there. He probably won't be. Uh, scouted. Nope, he got picked. God damn it. I knew it. Right? He's gone? Yeah, he is. Oh, well. I needed that lineman, dude. It, this game is ridiculous. We, we, you need lineman bad. So, All right, so the next thing is I can get a cornerback. A new tight end, a new running back, cornerback. Oh, defensive tackle with a first round overall grade, huh? All right, there we go. That'll help. He has a first round grade. It's the second round. There we go. All right, cool. All right, uh, skip ahead in the draft. Miss next user pick. All right, let's see here. What am I getting? I'm probably not going to trade many of these picks away. I just need I need depth everywhere in my team. So, all right. <clears throat> um, let's see here. All right. So I can get a running back, a cornerback, running back, running back, and then I'm getting into third round talent here. All right. So I actually my my cornerbacks are C plus. They're like the best on my team. All right. So out of these running backs, he is carrying ball care vision. He is, let's go, just go to running back. All right. Let's see here. So we have two, got three that are event. So carrying, ball carrier, elusiveness. He actually is the best out of all of them. He's four, five, four, five, four, four, but barely. Um, you know, I'm going to, I'm going to stretch, man. I'm going to go, I'm going to, I'm going to go for this dude because he's projected a second rounder. His talent is a second round talent. Let's do it. All right, cool. All right. I'm happy with that. All right. Let's go ahead and uh, skip ahead. Next user pick. All right. Let's see here. who we got here. All right. God, that quarterback is still there. He is dropped like a bitch. He's a first round at talent. Spencer afoot. What a piece of crap. All right. Um, let's see. Don't need that. Don't need that. Free safety. I don't need halfback. All right. Third round. Third round. Oh, third round. Third round. Now we're getting into four. So basically I got this right tackle, this wide receiver, catching, catching, short route, possession. Because I'm going to keep this West Coast, I believe, since that guy's so close to being a West Coast quarterback. Block shedding. I already, did I already draft a tackle? Quarterback, halfback, center, tackle. All right, so wide receiver or right tackle. Let's see here. Late third. Late third. This is the first pick in the third round. Damn it. All right. I think I'm going to trade this one, to be honest. I don't want to stretch. What kind of offers can I get for this? A third, a third, a second, a third, a third. All right. I guess I'll 
trade it for a second next year. I just don't want to stretch. Because all those guys were late third round. If it, if it wasn't like the first pick, holy shit. All right, let's see here. So pick player. Now let's see who's scouted. All right, so this, this wide receiver is still here. And this tight end has... All right, we'll go... We'll go with him. I mean, what's it hurt, right? Third round? Good pick. 65th overall. I got him at 74. All right, I'm so glad they fixed that in the in the draft here. So, <clears throat> this next user pick. Blada. All right. Make my selection. Pick player. All right, let's see what we got here. Scouted. God, that quarterback is still there. Part of me wants to grab him. You know what I mean? It's like, in case this guy doesn't work out, I mean, why would it why would it be bad to grab him? So I have two quarterbacks in case one sucks. Um, I'm not taking another running back. I already did that. Defensive tackle. I don't. All right. Riley Watson. All right. He has he has third round. He's scouted in the third round, fourth round, but he has third round talent. So he may be a little bit of a work in progress. But you know what? Fuck it. We'll see. Good pick. All right, cool. So I'm still getting players that are good picks. Um, I'll tell you what. If that quarterback is here in the next round in the fourth, when it's my pick, I'm taking him. He probably won't be. But I'm going to take him right now if he's there. Okay, somebody finally grabbed him. I was like, holy shit, dude. How long are you going to let this dude slide? All right, so who is the next fifth, fourth? Damn. It's like the only player I, that's in my... Hmm. Mid-third, huh? I'm going to trade this. I don't... I mean, I don't really have a... There's not really anybody... Um, ah, hold on. Let me see here. <clears throat> Scouted because I'm starting to get into the area where I don't have a ton of players scouted either. Um, Vinny Lindholm, huh? Mid fourth. I mean, it wouldn't hurt me to draft another quarterback, huh? I'm gonna do that. I reached ah, by two by two picks, so I mean, it'll be a good backup. Why not, right? I mean, shit. Do, 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 do. Here comes my pick. Make my selection. Pick player. All right. God, I don't have anybody scouted here, huh? Fifth, fifth, fifth. All right. Did I draft a right tackle? I did not. Right? I did not draft a, a right tackle. So I have two right tackles. Who are projected? Who have fifth round talent that are projected for the sixth round? So, this one: run block, pass block, run block, run block, pass block. I mean, they're both about equal. This dude's bigger. This guy fits my scheme though, so he'll get he'll gain faster. Eh, fuck it, let's grab him. I mean, there's not really much I can do at this point. All right, the next pick. All right, make my selection. Pick player. Uh, scouted. Let's see. Who's the next guy I have available? Oh, he's still there, so I'll, I'll just grab both of them. Fuck it, because I, I need depth. So, all right, they were both ranked 70 anyway. So, all right, skip ahead in the draft. Next user pick. Now I'm into the seventh round. So, these are going to be reaches, uh, because I don't think I have anybody fucking scouted, to be honest, in the seventh round. So... If I don't have any players scouted, then I will trade them all away. Yeah, I don't have anybody scouted. I'm not just going to like start blindly drafting people. So I will see what I can get for these. 6th, uh, 5th, 5th, 6th, 5th, 5th. God, 5th round picks? Okay. Uh, this one is projected to be the best. So I'll take it. That might just help me trade in the offseason next year. So, all right. Next user pick. 
All right, let's see here. Trade away pick. All right, seventh, six, seventh, 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 six, six. Uh, I'll go with the Browns. How come nobody's at okay. The That's because both teams are right now Let's working on draft. The Next user pick. The Austin right away pick. All right, we'll see what we can do here. Seven, 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 seven. Oh, six. All right, there we go. All right, anything I can get an early round, I'm going to take it. Uh, skip, because I don't really do much in the seventh round anyways, you know what I mean? So, all right, trade away pick. I'm so glad that people want them. I mean, they can take all these late round dudes. Seven, oh, there's a six, six. All right, I'll do, I haven't traded with the Raiders yet, so I'll do that. All right, now we can skip in the draft. Next user pick. All right, let's look at the draft recap here. All right, let's see how okay everybody is. All right, so my quarterback, 79. My center's a 76. My tackle's a 76. My running back's a 74. My wide receiver's a 74. My tight end's a 73. My other quarterback's a 72. The two right tackles are 70s. So, I mean, I got some good, uh, some good like depth on my team, and uh, so what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna go ahead and take a quick break. I'm gonna go see if I need to adjust my roster to move guys from like left tackle to right tackle, yada yada, um, and then I will come back um, and go from there. So we're getting here pretty close to the end of the off season, so uh, I'll be right back. Okay, everybody, I am back after the draft. Uh, I went through, I uh, signed some free agents that were left. Nobody of real note, just some people to fill in my roster. And here's basically what we're rolling with this first season with the Austin Desperados. Uh, we got this quarterback that I drafted. He's one of the best players on the team, 79 overall. Uh, running backs, we're going to keep Philip Lindsay as we get Deion Ellis up to speed. I'm going to try to actually see if I can go in and change their share 50-50. Um, fullback is eh, to be to be desired, I guess. Wide receiver, we're going to run with these guys. I'm going to let this rookie stay down here for a season um, because he's not that great. So, uh, Still going with Jake Butt, keeping Riley Watson at the back up here. Uh, my line... Got an 80 left tackle. Uh, oh, I need to put somebody here, huh? Uh, we'll take this guy, I guess, as the backup for that. So, All right, and then we go to center. So my line is so-so. Um, I picked up a few more rookies, a couple wide receiver rookies, uh, some lineman rookies, see if anybody makes a difference. So uh, left and we're going to have to use somebody. Uh, I guess we'll use Bo Allen as the third. All right. Same here. Got to use somebody. I guess we'll use Bo Allen as the third. And then uh, defensive tackle. We're going to roll with the rookie. All right. And I guess we'll use the back up. Cap Cappy. All right. So the linebacker, we're running... God, I must have cut these guys, and I didn't realize it. Um, Josie Jewell as my third string. Uh, linebackers. All right. So that guy up here. All right, and then we're running in. So, I mean, the team isn't great, but it also is quite a bit better than it was last season because last season it was just garbage. Um, so, I mean, I guess trash compared to garbage is always good. So, that's kind of where we're at. Uh, there's the kicker, the punter, um, kick returner. Who's going to do? Oh, DM Ellis. Uh, there we go. Get you, get you some use. And we use this rookie, actually, to get out here. Punt return. There you go, DM Ellis and Newman. All right, get these rookies out there. Um, who is going to be my slot receiver? That is what I'm wondering right now. Uh, third down running back. Oh, Jesus. God, everybody is terrible. So I guess I'm just going to use Dion for the third downs. Power back, I guess, will be Royce Freeman. 
slot wide receiver. Looks like Trent Taylor will be the slot wide receiver. Um, and then we'll just kind of go through here all these new specialized positions for uh, men. And we shall wrap everything up here so we can get into the season. So that is all the time that we have for today's episode. Thank you so much for hanging out with me on the off season uh, after I've deconstructed the Denver Broncos and relocated them to Austin, Texas as the Desperados. Now we uh, are going to try to rebuild these guys. So Please make sure you like, share, and subscribe. Leave me a couple comments. Let me know what you think about these videos. Is this something new that I'm doing for the channel? Uh, so, but for now, till we get into the season, for Jonas, I am.